Hello you guys. Okay, so this is a wig that I made a few weeks back. New part wig. I, put, I sewed two combs on the front. The um, cap itself came with an adjustable strap. That's just my braid pattern that I chose to use. You know me, give the hair a little shake, shake, shake. And I'm going to clip and clamp the hair. You know, just showing how I made the U part wig. Just clamp it on the outside fluff it out a bit and just want to make sure that it's secure you know with the strap and everything I am going to go in with my bobby pins you know just to add a little bit more security onto the wig um, a couple on the sides and I also put a few in the back as well and this hair was absolutely gorgeous don't mind my edges I'm going to get those together in just a second <laughs> probably look crazy but yeah just putting it down with a few body pins making sure that it's safe and secure can have my weed blowing all over the place child so yeah just trying to fluff that out a bit I got the security down packed this is just a little bit of water um, I'm just gonna start detangling the hair so that you guys can get the you know the true pattern on how it is when it's wet and the ends, that was the only con I had, uh, I had about this hair. The ends were a little brittle and a little dry, but um, just keep, you know, some water, and I usually mix it with a little bit of conditioner, you know, just to detangle the hair. I didn't miss go around. Just want to use water so that you can see that, you know, the true state of the hair. So yeah, just detangling away. Those ends were so frustrating, I can't even lie, but the hair was so gorgeous, I just overlooked those ends. See, look at, look at that wave once it's wet. It's like on a completely different level, not even joking. <laughs> yeah, just detangling away, trying to get these ends together. Child, they was just, they were not working with me at <laughs> all. Um, I think it's because I didn't use the conditioner like I usually do. But I didn't want to add the conditioner just yet. I wanted you guys to see, you know, how it looks with just the water itself. Because a lot of people don't like to put, you know, conditioner or any type of products in their hair at all. Me, on the other hand, you know, whatever it does to make the hair look good, that's what I'm going to use. But I didn't do it this go around. And I'm just trying to fluff it out. I'm mad at myself. I really wanted to get um, a really full effect. And I didn't get it, you know, the full, the fullest effect, Ooh, excuse me, that I wanted. But... It's still really gorgeous, especially when the water, you know, um, gets to it. It's beautiful. And the hair is really soft, just fluffing it out. Now to take care of this leaf out of mine. And I usually try to add a few curls in, but with this Brazilian hair, it for some reason it blends in perfectly with African American hair. Brazilian hair does, um, cause I order, you know, usually I get like Cambodian or Peruvian or something of that nature. But no, I wanted to get Brazilian with this, you know, to see how it would blend. And to help me blend, I'm going to use some of my foam magic. <laughs> That's what I like to call it. And it pretty much helps my hair curl on the ends a little bit so that it can, you know, blend a little bit better with the with the U part wig. And I'm not putting it all over my hair, just on the ends because, you know, that's where it has to blend with the curls. So, yep, yeah, just put a little bit in there. Trying to blend it in. And then I'm going to have to get these edges in order, honey, with my Ampro. Yes! I know people use, you know, some, what is it called, Gri Gorilla Snod and Got to Be Glued and all that, baby. All I needed me is some black girl gel, is what I like to call it. And that's all I really need. Um, I'm going to get that together with my toothbrush. Um, it's something about the fine, the fine brushes on the toothbrush that gets every single bit of hair. And I love using a toothbrush for my edges. It's just, I love it. I've been doing it for the longest. <laughs> I'm almost addicted at this point. And I kept having issues with my hair because I am natural. Been natural for about three years now. And huh, that natural hair life, honey, <laughs> it is so hard to try to maintain. Like, I was having a little bit of trouble trying to blend. I mean, it blended in, don't get me wrong, but it was poofing a little bit because, of course, natural hair sisters, you know, the hair gets poofy. Yeah, you know, then I had the mist from that water of spraying it. So I bet that didn't make it any better. <laughs> So, yep, just getting these edges together, smoothing those on down. 
fleekity fleek fleek baby yes 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 i look look i have to no matter if i'm getting a sew-in or whatever the case may be my edges have to be laid that's like black girl one-on-one like you can have a bomb sew-in and if your edges aren't laid it's just gonna make your hair look just foolish <laughs> so yep just put the a um the the black gel on my edges and i wrap it for about 15 minutes I wrap the hair for 15 minutes and that just helps it lay down it will harden a little bit which is I like it a lot of people don't like for their hair to get hard you know from the gel some people like for it to have like a soft mode no I like for mine to be hard because I know for sure that it's they're gonna stay laid for the you know the entire day so yep 15 minutes and we're back let's see how our molding turned out and I'm just gonna untwist. I put two big twists on there just to keep the curl, you know, with the curl pattern and everything. Fluff it out just a little bit. Separate the curls just a tad. And this hair and the curl and just everything, like, it was just giving me life. I'm trying to find ways to blend out my real hair because like I said, I'm natural. So it was taking a little bit of work, but it wasn't anything that I could manage. Yeah, but Nadella hair is really awesome. I'm going to make sure that I go to their website and leave them a good review because although it was taking a lot for me to do my blend, blending with my leave out, it was still some pretty good hair. So I'm going to make sure I do my part and give them, you know, two thumbs up on their website. I guess I feel like being generous. <laughs> but yep, this is the right side bam there's the left bam and the curls are popping for the girls honey so yep this is the hair nadula and i love it what is up you guys it's your girl <laughs> What is up, you guys? It's your girl C, and I'm back with another one. I'm sorry. Look, I was gone for a week, but I'm back like I never left. My schedule has been super hectic, but I'm back. Y'all knew I wasn't going to be gone for long, and I'm coming at you today with a wig made by myself, boo. Who you, you thought I was going to tell you something? No, I made this one, but I'm taking full credit the hair i got the hair from nadula and let me tell you about it i had kept hearing different things about nadula hair company i think they're new they just started and they have a they have a store on amazon and they also have a store on aliexpress i happened to get the hair from amazon.com at the time because don't quote me i heard that their prices are going up i think they were running a special i got three different bundles for the price of 105 dollars boo like Moment of silence for this price. Okay, now nah, for real. This hair is so soft. I made this unit about three weeks ago and I wanted to come to you guys, not when it was fresh out the package because let's be real, all hair feels good fresh out the pack. No, I wanted to put a little wear and tear to it just to see, you know, how it was gonna hold up all my life there was no shedding y'all know how i feel about shedding boo so you know i'm not gonna tell you nothing wrong when i say like look nothing not, nothing like no shedding whatsoever i am mad at myself though because i really wanted the hair to be bigger and i mean it's kind of big and mind you i only have three bundles and i, I would have got at least one more bundle you know, just to make it, give it a, it just needed one more and it would have gave it what it needed. But I'm not going to complain. Now, I'm, y'all know, I'm going to keep it real with y'all. The only con about this hair is the ends. You do, like, the ends get a little dry. As you can see, they get a little dry. So, you, um, you might want to keep, you know, I got, I got a spray bottle and this is just, uh, water for right now but you can put a little bit of conditioner here and just keep this in your purse and just you know just spray it throughout the day or whatever the case may be nothing major i mean you get what you pay for it was only 100 bucks but the hair i mean that's the only con though like so you know that would be up to you to decide if you would want to deal with that or not but i that's something minor to me i would rather have to spray it a little bit than you know to be shedding like a dog 
just everywhere you go, you just shedding off a trail of just nonsense behind you. But anyway, this hair is everything, y'all. I can't, I can't explain, you know, I can't explain any further. There's nothing more else to say. This, I will, I will definitely shop with Nadula again. No doubt about it. And I wanted some curly hair, something short. I didn't want anything too long because I was making a U-part wig. And I'm going to be honest with you. I didn't know how I would like the wig because I haven't worn leave out or my hair out in so long. So I was like, okay, this is going to take some getting used to. But it blended in perfectly for me. I put a little Ampro drill up. Uh, drill. Lord have mercy. <laughs> I put a little bit of Ampro on my edges and uh, brushed it up with a toothbrush. And I don't know what it is about the toothbrush, but it just does one. It just does something that a brush can't do, okay? I bet y'all was like, oh, I'm trying to use that with her mouth. No, boo. That's just for my, it's my edge brush. Okay. <laughs> but yes, I absolutely love this hair. Out of 10, I'll give it a 9. The only reason why I'm giving it a 9 is because of the, you know, inconvenience of you having to, you know, keep the hair conditioned um, for the ends being dry. Yeah, you can't pass up $100 for bundles, especially some of good quality. So, and let me just say, any hair company, let me get this out the way. Any hair company that I ever mention, they do not sponsor me. Every single thing that you see on my page is me spending my hard-earned money. I don't want y'all to think that, oh, they're paying her to give good reviews. No, none of that. I don't, no, I'm not playing that. And even if, you know, later on down the line, I do start to do a few tutorials based off me sponsoring with some of the companies. I'm going to give you guys 100% honesty from the bottom of my heart. I, like trust me I'm not here for that no because I would be very upset if I were to spend my hard earned cash and somebody you know was getting paid to you know give real reviews and I get the hair and it's trash like no but these are the ends this is the back but yeah baby I love me some Nadula huh? yeah this is a U-Par wig made by myself if you are interested in fact to get a wig made by myself I will put the information down below on how you can contact me and we'll work some things out and I will get you a wig made I do ship any and everywhere I don't care where you're located just let me know you know just let me know if you're interested but yeah I'm actually about to get ready to do another tutorial, however, because I know there are a few thrifty girls like myself, but I have um, the Dominican Curly by Avtray. I'm super duper excited to do the tutorial on this one. It is, in fact, a half wig. I'm just trying to switch it up. You know, I didn't want to keep having, you know, the lace fronts or, you know, things like that. I want to, you know, at least show a little bit of my hair. I know all girls don't like to keep their hair covered and everything, but yeah. So I'm about to get prepared to do this tutorial. But yeah, this uh, this hair by Nadula, I give it two thumbs up. It is amazing. Um, they contacted me uh, each, it took two days. Yes, it took two days to get here. I was super duper shocked. I had ordered it on a Thursday and it came Saturday morning. I was super shocked, but they kept in contact with me the entire time. You know, your package is here, you know, at this location, it'll be there. Like they great communication with the company so yeah i don't have any cons with the company i will put a picture to show you how it came i was trying to find the box and i happened to misplace it i'm gonna be honest with you but i'm gonna show you how it came packaged it was really cute they give you a free pair of lashes um i didn't use the lashes they weren't dramatic enough for me i guess i would say because i like long and you know long lashes but they had it packaged pretty nice there was no smell no shedding uh, no problems at all. The only thing, like I said, is the ends, but that's something minor. Um, so yeah, I will put the link down below on how I, uh, where I got the hair from, and I will get prepared to uh, do this next tutorial. So until next time, beauties, it's your girl C, and you'll be seeing more of me. Hope you enjoy my video.